Amongst the millions of users whose data was leaked by Facebook, 5 lakh were Indian. So far, personal data has been governed by SPD rules, but these have offered little protection against the misuse of confidential information. The Aadhaar database is prone to leaks and hacks, even the right to privacy was toothless. But then, Europe released its GDPR. This protects a person and their digital footprint, and now India's new privacy law follows in its footsteps. The Shri Krishna Committee sets up an independent regulatory body to protect your personal data, to make sure it is only being used for what it was intended for, and to slap heavy penalties on any entity that doesn't comply. But our country has 500 million active internet users, who are auto-filling forms, saving passwords, allowing permissions and access every day. And with Digital India, we'll be generating even more data. This new Personal Data Protection Bill 2018 does not say who owns your data, does not make it easy for you to restrict disclosure, and it simply does not allow you to be forgotten. Data privacy laws should protect people, not data. Consent is not an end in itself. But all this is in the future, once this bill, or an upgraded one, becomes a law. Until then, watch this video to know who can legally access your data and how they do it. But before you click away, like this video and subscribe to our channel.